Hey guys, I'm back, and we're about to watch a dream, just like last time, I'm not going to talk, so here we go.
All right, that was the end of the of the thing, the dream. Uh, I'm running back here to make sure that uh, there isn't a platform for me to go on over here. I didn't really like that dream. I usually like most of them. That one wasn't one of my favorites. Oh, oh well. They can't all be winners. I guess this means this is where I'm supposed to go. Alright, we're back in New Mora. Why exactly? I'm not totally sure. Beloved citizens of Ura, I am Tolton, son of the late King Cypher. Please heed my words. At this moment, our nation is... Oh, if it isn't that little scamp from Ura. It's the council. I wonder what's going on. What would be so important that they'd have to broadcast it around the world? ...that on the Wall Highlands into such a tragedy. I am overwhelmed with shame at the number of people who died in that battle. Furthermore, I must inform the people that His Excellency, the Venerable Chairman Roxian, who has led the council since our nation became a republic, has passed away due huh? to a sudden hmm. illness. His Excellency hmm. felt a terrible sense of responsibility. Do you understand any of this? The there were a lot of words I heard in my history class. That to save Ura, the monarchy must be restored immediately. Therefore, in accordance with His Excellency's dying wish, I hereby declare that henceforth the republic shall be abolished. And the council shall be dissolved. Huh, Golden Boy sure taking a lot of initiative there. It's Gongora's plotting. The boss? I don't get it. They're trying to stop something, right? I, as the first in line to the throne, shall with honor bear the crown as 45th King of Ura. Also, oh, 45. Oh, thanks for clearing it up. I thought you were 44. Incumbent on the ruler of this nation, I shall appoint His Excellency Gongora. A sorcerer of vast experience as my royal advisor and second in command. <sighs> well, it shall be a great honor to accept your majesty's appointment. He sure knows how to ham it up. What? Did, did he just say royal advisor? He's kidding, right? It's nothing but government by regent. My beloved citizens, Allow me to illustrate one of the reasons that I reached this difficult decision. Huh? It's me! Look it! They must be planning to invade Ura. Is that my voice? What is this? How should I know? As you can see, it has been refitted with weapons. Do you understand what this means? Numara, like Kent before it, is bearing its aggressive fangs at our country. In this time of crisis, our country no longer has a standing army to protect us. Our army was swept up in the devastation at the Wall Highland. It is in times like these when a king who can lead Ura to victory, like my late father, is indispensable. Jansen, what the hell is this? Explain yourself. I'm telling you, I don't know anything. You've been used. Me? By Gungora? You gotta be kidding me. I was just in it for the money. There, see? He let it slip. Yeah, okay. So now you know. But all he asked me to do is keep an eye on you guys. You gotta believe me. Then what was that black pearl all about? Well, look, that, that was, uh, well... Kaim, that, this uh, guy's bad news. Uh, you should get rid of him. We need to deal with him before we look for Sarah. Gungora might even be listening in on this conversation. Hey, hey, wait a minute. Okay, you don't know the whole story. Let me it just. It doesn't matter. Kaim? 
Let him hear us. Let him see us. Let him shudder as we close in on him. You are creeping me out. Man, you know, he's a handful even after getting his memories back. Where did I put that pearl? Dum 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 dum. Anyways, I want to heal. It won't open. Are you shitting me? Hey, I've seen those guys before. What? Uh, what's going on? Ow, that... Hey, who threw that? What the? Yep. This is fun to watch. Hey, it's you! You're the Orin spies! Spies? We've got nothing to do with this. Here's your spy. Yeah, what? Hey, don't point your finger at me. Ura's gonna attack Numara, isn't it? It's all your fault! <laughs> well, looks like our uh, next best strategy is to leave town. I still want to see if I can go in here. Nope, still locked. What was this examine I saw? Oh, come on. How was I supposed to r notice that? attack is it what what's an ordinary attack cook Mac now's the chance for you to slip into the smoke and run what no way move if you stay here you'll be in our way and that's not true we're in this together let's go Mac. don't worry we'll be fine I say we surprise him by running away you shut up what You know, I think they've noticed us. Kaim? If we put up a struggle here, we could end up triggering outright war between Ura and Numara. So that means we should do... what? Don't move! If you resist, you'll regret it! So, we, we let ourselves get caught. Uh, that, that's brilliant! We should let them know fighting won't solve anything. Then we'll need the power of the Queen. Power of the Queen. Good idea. You know me and the Queen are tight. Yeah, we go way back. No problem. Yeah, right. You're wise to surrender, spies. We're not spies. We want to speak to the proper authorities. If you're not spies, then what is the meaning of this? What is the meaning of what? Hmm. 
For ordinary travelers, you've certainly managed to get involved in some extraordinary events. I apologize for pretending to be something I'm not. I just want you to hear me out. Oh, I'll hear you out. You're going to tell me what Ura is plotting. Well, see, now there's no surprise. They were going to throw your birthday party. Where's the queen? That's gonna hurt. Who do you think you're talking to? <sighs> Idiot. What's that look for? Hmm. This fellow senses something unusual in your eyes. What? Huh? Well then, let's expose those eyes for what they really are. Our country's sorcerers have some impressive powers themselves. I am Flatter General. Do it. Yes, sir. Ahoy! Whoa! Jansen! Wow, do you see what I'm seeing? Because I'm... that's... Are those mine? Those are mine. Ah. They're mine? Oh. These are without doubt crystals of magic energy. What this man sees is passed along to another sorcerer through these lenses of light. They are called spy eyes. And they allow a sorcerer to see everything the wearer sees. Awfully elaborate stunt to pull, even for a spy. Hey, you know, I had no, I am not that smart. I mean, I'm not saying I'm dumb, I just, I didn't know. Excuse me, General, but this man is most likely telling the truth. What? The person in which spy eyes are implanted would not be aware of them. I could tell that much when I remove them. This is high-level magic far beyond the capabilities of someone such as myself. Even with your power, you could not do it? As you say, sir. Ah, I can't believe I... He was just using me. Of all the times to figure that out. I am gonna make that greedy, senile, flea-infested bastard pay! Huh. You won't have time for that, spies. Kill them. Well, all right then. There was just no getting through to that guy. You don't have much of a choice. Well, this is a surprising turn of events. Well, I'm going to pause it and I'll fight him next episode. See ya.